And a number of events planned across Metro Atlanta are still happening while others have been scaled down. CBS 46's Barmel Lyons joins us live with how locals are spending their holiday. Barmel. Well, guess what? The city is filled with people from out of town and locally who are all just here to celebrate Labor Day weekend. I want to give you a sneak peek of just how packed we're looking at it. You can see some people with masks without but everyone here to have a good time hopefully social distancing when they get inside but take a look at some events and businesses coming their way you can see them saying hi there are ways to celebrate while still also remaining safe the city of atlanta is open and the community refuses to let covid19 put a stop to their labor day festivities kern williams says he's here for atlanta black pride weekend and believes celebrating is more important this year than ever. With the Black Lives Matter movement, with all the police brutality where black men are being murdered, I think it's really important to celebrate black lives. At the same time, we don't want black lives being taken away by whether it be the police or by COVID. Another event people typically make their way to Atlanta for is Dragon Con. Dragon Con is an annual multimedia and pop culture event that usually fills the streets with hundreds of people. But because of COVID-19, they're going fully virtual. They've been doing Facebook Live panels. Um, they've been doing YouTube. They even got on Roku. And Elisa Gonzalez says she misses the energy of jam-packed streets, but understands public safety. It's really weird because I'm so used to coming into Atlanta and it being just crowded streets, so many people, so many costumes, so many cosplays, so many actors just walking around and it's been so normal and just so like almost to me barren. Also in full swing is Black Restaurant Week, a week focused on helping venues including Escobar who've been hit hard by the financial burdens of COVID-19. I think that's what's great about our community is that there's a lot of diversity, there's a lot of variety, there's something for everyone. I'm here for all of it, um, but just as long as we're being safe at the same time. Yes, safety first. A lot of doctors in this community that we've talked to throughout the week emphasizing wearing your mask, social distancing, washing your hands. Behind me, you can still see a long line of people. People are coming out this weekend. But as we've been told, safety is first. Make sure you're careful. In Atlanta, I'm Barma Lyons, CBS 46 News.